I'm Tracy K. Smith, and I'm excited to help celebrate the Poetry Society's 110th birthday. I'm going to be reading Robert Hayden's poem, Frederick Douglass, which was originally published in 1947. This is a poem that seeks to celebrate the vision and the conscience of Frederick Douglass. And it's also a poem in which the speaker is trying to urge us to make good now upon the vision and the sense of courage and equality, the sense of democracy that Douglass understood and championed. Frederick Douglass. When it is finally ours, this freedom, this liberty, this beautiful and terrible thing, needful to man as air, usable as earth, when it belongs at last to all, when it is truly instinct, brain matter, diastole, systole, reflex action, when it is finally won, when it is more than the gaudy mumbo jumbo of politicians, this man, this Douglas, this former slave, this Negro beaten to his knees, exiled, visioning a world where none is lonely, none hunted, alien, this man, superb in love and logic, this man shall be remembered. Oh, not with statues rhetoric, not with legends and poems and wreaths of bronze alone, but with the lives grown out of his life, the lives fleshing his dream of the beautiful, needful thing. <laughs>